E3 here. Embodied, empowered, and ecstatic. There's been so much pain recently. And the painkillers, either they're not working or I'm just looking at the ones that are available. Either they're not working or the ones that are available have these toxic, evil side effects. Like it literally feels like a poison in the body. So I haven't taken those, such as Percocet and um, Norco. It's called Norco, N-O-R-C-O. Um, so it's been a good practice in being present. Sometimes it feels like a deep, dark black hole of pain that if I resist, the pain just gets worse. If I try to push through, the pain gets worse. Um, if I breathe too deep, the pain gets worse. If I talk too much, the pain gets worse. Even right now, the pain is pretty bad. Um, so it's a very good practice in being present uh, and not being a victim or uh, not being, not letting the passive machine mind fill up my consciousness. Because there's pain. It's just a 3D sensation, uh, but there is zero suffering. I have that uh, choice. Now, it's not always easy to not suffer and to not let the fear and the uh, especially the fearful projections fill up my consciousness, but it's getting better every day and I'm grateful for that. And that's my commitment to myself. For my own benefit and for the benefit of many, many people. Uh, so this, this E3 affirmation practice, it's the name that my shaman and teacher gave me last year. He didn't tell me to use it as an affirmation or as an inner mantra, but if you've never worked with a shaman before, a lot of the communication happens telepathically from heart to heart. So I got the message in my heart that this, the E3 is not just a name, but it's an affirmation of who I am. It's not all of who I am, but it's if we're going to have an affirmation, why not have a cool affirmation? An affirmation that supports our unique vibration. An affirmation that gets us into our unique flow state. And an affirmation that supports our unique life purpose. And also an affirmation that helps us be a positive influence on other people and helps us be a channel of great spirit. So um, that's why I'm using this affirmation. And then the reason that I'm making these videos is because I am putting out the energy and the positive expectation that I will heal the stage four brain cancer. I will fully heal the head infection. I will fully strengthen and prepare for the next head surgery in a month or two to put in a new plate in my head. I think they're going to 3D print pieces of my skull that they took out and they're going to put them back in put the skin flap back over that and I will fully recover from that so that's why I'm making these videos now with that positive expectation so with that being said I'm going to use the rest of my energy right now for the E3 affirmation hey hey put in a pad oh thanks on your eyes Awesome. That way when they start leaking, there's something soaking it up. I'm making a, a video now. Oh, am I 
interrupting your video, I'm sorry. No, not at all. I'm just letting you know if you're wondering who, who am I talking to. So we have the best nurses in Charlotte, I would say. We try to be good. So, yeah, this is not easy. This affirmation right now, it's so painful. A lot of the time it's even painful to think too much, let alone to have uh, like intense thoughts. It's a very cool learning experience about the brain since brain surgery and how, like, this is a whole other topic, but how are thoughts and consciousness related to the brain? Okay, so may this prayer go out to every cell and go into every cell in my body. And may this positive energy have a positive impact on all aspects of my life. And may this positive energy go out to all beings on all realms, that I may contribute to the positive energy growing in humanity, in the animals and the earth. I am embodied. I am empowered. I am ecstatic. I am embodied. I am empowered. I am ecstatic. I am embodied. I am empowered. I am ecstatic. <laughs> Just as I am. And may you be as well. E3 here, wishing you well.